So uh, the competition can best be defined as the process in which the fitness of one species. Now fitness is measured in the form of R value. We have learned that already in the life history variations also Darwinian fitness. Uh, intrinsic rate of the increase is going to be reduced is significantly lower in the presence of another species. It is relatively easy to demonstrate this in the laboratory. Now we all know in a confined zone, in a cage, it is easy to perform experiments about, about competition. But when we talk about natural places where animals have infinite ways of migration also to avoid competition. So in a cage, in a laboratory experiment, it is easy to show that competition will cause death of one species that is the uh, weak one and the survival of the strong fish, uh, species but this is not always true because every species wish to uh, wish to continue its existence and no species wants to be completely extinct from the wild so let's go from the ncrt first so uh, it is relatively easy to demonstrate these things in the laboratory experiment as it was done by Gauss and his other experimental ecologists. When resources are, li are limited, when resources are limited, competitively superior species will eventually eliminate the other species. So if there is resources limited, obviously competition is going to be stiff. So the species which is stronger is definitely going to win in this competition and finally what will happen the weaker species will go under the process called as extinction. So that is called here as elimination of the other species. But evidence for such competitive exclusion occur in nature is not always conclusive. But there are some examples where it has been found that the stronger species wo was not able to cause elimination of the weak one. So let's learn the examples from book first. So strong and persuasive circumstantial evidences are there which show something else. Now the, for example, the example of, uh, of a, a Bingdon tortoise found in Galapagos Island. So when goats were introduced by human in Galapagos Island, we all know goats walk faster. Goats are supposed to be browsing or feeding faster. So their pattern of feeding is um, more compared to the tortoise, a very slow moving animal. So uh, as long as a Bingdon tortoise was not disturbed in its area by goat, because goats were not naturally found there, the tortoise was able to survive there. But the tortoise became extinct in Galapagos Island because human introduced their goats and goats apparently have greater browsing efficiency because of which the tortoise became extinct. Now another example for another evidence for the occurrence of competition in nature comes from what is called as competitive release. Now what is competitive release? That when you uh, remove the strong species you will find that the weak species will quickly take over the whole area and they start using the resources faster and they will increase their population also fast. This is called as competitive release. Let's go through the NCRT. A species whose distribution is restricted to a small geographical area. So a species which is weak one will definitely be found in a small geographical area because of the presence of a competitively stronger species or superior species is found to. Now, when once we remove the stronger species in an experiment, when the competing species stronger one is experimentally removed, it was found that, that the weaker species is going to expand in its distributional range dramatically uh, when the competing species is removed. Now Connell's elegant field experiment, another field experiment, you need to learn all these examples from the NCRT for board. So Connell's elegant field experiment uh, showed that on a rocky sea coast of Scotland. So now this example is from the Scotland. The previous example was from the Pacific coast of America. So it was found uh, on the rocky sea coast of Scotland that there are two types of ba barnacles. Barnacles are, they belong to arthropoda family and they belong to the group called as crustaceans. So crustaceans are the second most abundant after the insecta among arthropods. So among arthropods there are some animals which are called as barnacles. Barnacles are found in the rocky sea coasts of Scotland and uh, scientists found that there are stronger species as well as weaker species of barnacles in that coast, coastal area of Scotland. So the example given here is that 
there is a superior barnacle that is the balanus and then there is a in, there is a weaker one which is called as the cathamulus so let's go through the ncrt uh, the larger and competitively superior barnacle dominates the intertidal area and excludes the smaller barnacle that from that zone so as long as the stronger species was there it was found the weaker uh, weaker species that means the uh, cathamulus was not able to survive in that zone where the balanus was dominating because balanus is a superior species in competition when compared with the smaller one that is the cathamulus so uh, in experiment it was even found that if you remove the the balanus from that area cathamulus will start expanding in its area a lot because the weaker one is now able to fully utilize the resources because of the concept of competitive release so in general we believe that herbivores and plants they face more stiff competition compared to the carnivores the reason is very obvious that plants are stationary they cannot go they cannot migrate if there is competition they have to they need to stand there itself and compete for resources and similarly when you pay attention to the food chains uh, the herbivores at the first tr second trophic level in the food chain they face more competition compared to the top carnivores or compared to the next trophic levels now next thing is 